take a look at this video. Police say this is the night Terry Williams was reported missing by his girlfriend. You could see a white Ford truck pulling into Williams driveway, getting closer to the door. After a man and a woman get out of the car, walk to the door and open it with keys. I think everybody was kind of shocked and sad and saying, well, what in the world is going on, you know? How could this happen? And how could they get the key? Emma Cook is a longtime friend of Williams, and she says it's not like him to have given his belongings to strangers. Someone had to give those people those keys. Investigators say the house was a mess when they got there, and Williams' body was missing for two days until it was found burning in East Mountains. I've tried to figure out every scenario, how this happened, why this happened, and I'm at a dead end on it. Investigators say his body was found by someone driving by. They say it was so badly burned they had trouble identifying him at first. I couldn't believe it happened like that. I'm like, wow, you know, somebody hated him that much. I've been knowing him for a long time. Good guy, help you if he can, you know, and for this to happen is just tragic. Cook says she overheard a heated conversation he was having with someone days before he disappeared. Well, he was being threatened on the phone. And uh, he took on off. I didn't get a chance to ask him who's, who's threatening. Regardless of what happened, Williams' friends are hoping justice is served. It's just hopefully they catch who did it, you know, because nobody should die like that. Reporting in Albuquerque, KD Munch, KOAT Action 7 News.